Yo, what is up, you guys? Welcome back to another great, awesome video. Like always, and you already know, here on Scissor TV. Now, as you see, and as you can tell by the title of the video, I did do another recent pickup on Dare to Play, a sneaker shop that is nearby my local outlet, or should I say mall, either or. Um, I decided to pick these up in a different colorway. Um, I, I believe I showed you guys the black and white colorway. This time, this is a different colorway. So without further ado, let's get right to it. So this is the Reebok Answer 4 in a size 11 and a half. As you guys already know, that is my actual size. Then again, some sizes can be different. 12 or 11 and a half it all depends on the shoe if it fits big or if it fits small but um yeah i decided to pick these up these are really clean uh i couldn't sleep on these and you would not believe how much i got these for honestly so but a lot of people they're just sleeping on these shoes honestly guys but if you guys get yourselves or see these in your local mall or local sneaker store make sure to get them because who knows what will be the next time you will actually see an answer for just sitting there in shelves. You know, because when I grew up watching Allen Iverson and uh, Kobe Bryant, these guys were just phenomenal, you know. As you can see, Reebok, AI3, Allen Iverson. Uh, the box is very unique, if you ask me, you know. It brings back a lot of... A lot of childhood memories, if you ask me. Um, a couple logos are at the bottom of the box. Um, but yeah, Reebok logos for days. Um, I don't think it says the actual original retail price. Usually it would say like a tag right here on the left side. But yeah, it's a men's basketball shoe, Reebok. So let's get, let's get right into the box opening. Are you guys ready for this? I haven't said this in a while, but let me get a drum roll, please. All right, so here we go. You guys ready? All right. So here we go. Reebok leaf paper. All right. So here they are, you guys. This is a different color. I decided to pick them up. And yes, I did try them on at the store, as you see, with the, uh, the zipper. And the strap already. But they're still pretty clean, you know. As you see. From the outsole. Or the bottom of the sole. You got Alan Iverson's face right there. Then you got like a message at the bottom of the. Of the sole. Only the strong survive. And you got DMX right here. At the heel tab of the shoe. Rest in peace to DMX. And then this plate is a carbon fiber plate. In the middle of the shoe. You know, for, for support. Um... But yeah, the quality and leather of this shoe is just cheese. It's like nice, soft, buttery leather. And you guys won't believe high quality. Like, as you see, like, the quality of this. Like, man. I mean, this colorway was just a really slept-on colorway. Usually, a lot of people picked up the black and white. I wanted to double up, but, you know, once I saw this colorway, which I did not see in shelves when I picked up the black and white one, for those of you that haven't seen the video, make sure to go check it out. But this is the Reebok Allen Iverson Air and Sephora in the white, blue, and red colorway. This is like a USA colorway, I believe. Make sure to let me know in the comments below what answer for this is. Is this like an all-star answer for or a USA uh, answer for? I'm not sure. There's also a couple of answer for PEs. That uh, I've been trying to get my hands on to. You know, of course, there is a Reebok question mid. Uh, everybody knows about those. Uh, Kobe Bryant, Balden, the Reebok question mid, which is a white, yellow player exclusive specifically for Kobe. So I'm still trying to get my hands and look out for that shoe, which is Reebok. You know, when uh, before Adidas, uh, Kobe was rocking, uh, or I believe it was Adidas and then Reebok. So. Let me know in the comments below. So, yeah, this is the uh, answer for uh, 
Reebok Allen Iverson sneaker right here, as you guys see. Same, nothing much has changed on you know on the strap, and also the tongue. The the, the tongue detail is technically the same as the black and white sneaker, and that's of course you know the insole is is detailed with uh, Allen Iverson's tattoos on his right or left uh, arm sleeve, as you see. You guys can see that. There's a lot of detail when it comes to these uh, Nike, uh, I mean Nike, what the heck am I saying? With these uh, Reebok shoes, when it comes to, you know, Under Armour, uh, Nike. It's just amazing how they made these shoes back in the day. It just brings back a lot of memories when I was a little kid. Let's get to the other side of the shoe. Uh, so here it is. The right-hand side of the Allen Iverson Answer 4. Almost the same thing as the as the left side. You got Iverson on the heel tab of the shoe. Got the Reebok logo at the bottom. And then this is different. From the back, I3 with gold, black, and red. But the, with the other black and white Iverson, it had like a different detail. I'm not sure what it was, but the stitching and the leather quality of this shoe is just, as you guys see, Nice, soft, and, and buttery. Um, same Kuiper fiber plate in the mid, in the middle of the, sh in the, of the sole. I3. Um, same message, only the strong survive. And you got the Allen Iverson. The bad son of a gun of the league back in the day. Um, but yeah, that is the... Uh, that is the answer for I mean, just the look of it and the way it stands out by looking at it far away. It's just a, uh, it's just a nice shoe, you know. Not every day you get to walk into a store, get a fresh pair. And let me show you the receipt, how much I got these for you guys. So I saved the receipt, and uh, this is what I paid for. And you guys are not gonna believe me. So yeah, so here it is. Here's my receipt, proof. Let's see if it focuses. There we go. The answer for white. You they were going for retail 110 and I paid 59.54. And there was no refund, so I can't exchange them or I can't return them. So I'm not going to. So this is the place where I got them from. You know, Athletes Foot at my local mall. But um, yeah. This is the answer for. Let me close the box up, put the paper in. Let me put them in a better bird's eye view for you guys to see. And shout out to Allen Iverson. You know, this guy was just a baller back in the day. He was an amazing player. Um, put these on top right here. Uh, this is just one phenomenal sneaker. If you guys look at it side by side. Um, just amazing the quality and the leather. Now with the lighting, you can see it a bit more better. But uh, I do have a couple t-shirts, you know, back when he was with the uh, Philadelphia 76ers. There's one of them, 2001, that was the day. I was 10 years old uh, back in that time. Mitchell and Ness. Then on the back of it, you know, Iverson. So, yeah, when I wear, like, the black and white sneaker, I'm going to rock this shirt. And then with this one, I could rock this with a, you know, you can never go wrong with the red throwback Mitchell and Ness Sixers uh, Allen Iverson t-shirt. Hardwood Classics Mitchell and Ness. So, these will go good with the, uh, with this shirt right here. Because with a little bit of the red, you know, and the soft buttery leather. And uh, before I end this video, let me uh, show you guys something special that I recently picked up, not just with the uh, the Allen Iverson shoe, but let me just take a quick, quick second. Hold on, you guys.
All right, so sorry for the wait. So here's the big surprise that I got for you guys, not just with the uh, Answer 4 sneaker, but I saw this in one of the memorabilia uh, sneaker stores. And I just, just decided to pick it up because, you know, for the memory, you know, it's already been three years since Kobe's passing. So I had to pick this up, too. My favorite players in the league. First is, you know, Mamba. Mamba forever. And, of course, second, Allen Iverson. So when I picked these up, I had to pick this up. Kobe Bryant, Allen Iverson, Hall of Fame 2016. This is one plaque, you know, I will not see ever again. And I'm not sure what kind of answer uh, Allen Iverson is balling. But these are my two favorite players uh, growing up, you know, when I was a little kid, a little munchkin. So got the T-shirts. You know, this one I'll rock it with, the, uh, with these Allen Iversons, you know, whenever I get the chance. I'm not going to ball them just to... Just wear them as a sneaker. And then this one, well, as you guys saw in my other video, I could rock them with the, the black and white ones. So with that being said, you know, shout out to Kobe Bryant. It's been three years. And uh, Gigi Bryant since his passing. So I'll probably put this in a, in a nice, nice wall. And uh, Mamba Forever, this is the, the uh, question mid. Uh, P.E. Reebok that I was telling you guys. So, shout out to Kobe Bryant. Um, it's been two days since his, uh, three years since his passing. So, just want to give a shout out. Rest in peace to the Mamba. Uh, one of my favorite all-time, favorite players of all time. So, um, so that is the Reebok question, man, that he is rocking. It's a P.E. Still trying to look. And I'll be patient to try to get my hands into that shoe. But, uh. Yeah, you guys, I just want to end this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Uh, drop a like. Leave the, some comments, some love. You know, on the bottom of the video, I'll gladly read them. You know, reply to you guys. And uh, if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to su subscribe. Because 2023 is going to get crazier from here on forward. You know, like I did say in my other videos, you know, this is just the beginning. So I just want you to guys to subscribe. And... Uh, Drop your likes, show me some love in the comments, and I'll gladly read them, you know. So I've been Scissor TV, you guys. Make sure you go. Stay tuned for another great awesome video because I do have some more things on the way. And uh hoping you guys enjoy it. So I'll catch you guys next time with another great awesome video. And stay safe, stay warm, because I know it's been really cold. Snow is getting crazier from here. And uh all right, so I'll end it that way. Catch you guys next time. Peace.